what's going on riders today we're out here on this 2021 harley davidson road king can you believe this bike has under 300 miles on it but we're not going to talk about specifics of this bike alone today i know previously i used to always talk about how um i'm i'm not a bagger bro um i'm not into getting a bagger right now you know i just did not want to get a bagger well lately i've been riding a lot of baggers and i got five reasons i kind of want a bagger now so that's what we're gonna talk about today let's get it <laughs> feels good today to not have my backpack on i got camera gear and other stuff all right there in the bag so i'm i don't even got no backpack on backpack backpack look at that bike though what do y'all think of that bike bike looks good it's got tab performance on it wait till y'all hear it when i crank it up man this thing sound good y'all know how i feel about a good sounding motorcycle but yeah, it's a Road King. Got the classic windshield, that classic, classic look. Of course, if I was to get one, you know, I would completely change up probably everything. But 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 let's get into it. Let's talk about five reasons why I kind of want a bagger. One of the reasons was what you just saw. Reason number one is the storage. You know, I can put stuff in the bags. These bags are a lot bigger than the bags that are on my V-Ride. The V-Ride has the leather bags that I added on, but this bike comes with those hard bags and there is so much room in there. There's so much that I could carry in those bags. I'm loving the storage on these touring bikes. I'm loving it. Well, let's crank her up. All right, so real quick before I crank it up, how many of you have heard the Tab Performance exhaust? What do you think this exhaust is going to sound like? Now, remember, it's coming out of a Milwaukee 8. So, is it going to sound insane? Is it going to be eargasmic? Or is it just going to be, eh? Write your comments right now. Before I hit this button in 3, 2, 1. I took a little longer because I know sometimes it takes a little bit for y'all to type. <laughs> Ooh-wee! Do you hear that? I really hope this mic is picking it up. Let me close my shield now. This exhaust sounds so good. It's music to my ears. Oh my goodness. I'm loving the sound of them pipes, especially when I just went under that little bridge tunnel thing. It resonated or echoed. That thing sounds good. All right, so. Gonna bust this turn. And get out here on the road so we can open this girl up a little bit. Not a lot, just a little. Come on, come on, player. You stopping my, my fun right now. Do you hear that? Oh my goodness, that bike sounds nuts. All right, so let's get into reason number two of why I'm kind of wanting, craving, and thinking about a bagger lately. It's the comfort. Y'all know, I don't have the most comfortable motorcycles. I got a Sportster. I got a V-Rod, which is my most comfortable bike. I got the Ducati and I got a Z125 Pro. None of those are really designed for long distance. Of course, I made my V-Rod a long distance rider, but 
is it really a long distance rider it has such a small gas tank the amount of times i have to stop to fuel up on that thing if i want to do some distance it's just a little bit much versus these touring bikes got these six gallon tanks so uh, i'm, I'm kind of going into into reason number three but we're gonna stay on reason two and then i'll jump back to reason three reason two is just the comfort it's extremely comfortable like the seating position the floorboards the seats you know they even place the bars in a comfortable position which most likely if i had a touring bike i would swap out the bars but overall it's just comfortable as hell like the bike is like it's like sitting on a sofa or like or like miss rada's lazy boy that she does not allow me to sit on it's like sitting on that it's just extremely comfortable touring bikes are just comfortable machines oh i can't stop revving this boy or girl or whatever oh 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 <laughs> Oh my God, it sound good. And I'm a two in the one man and it, these are still dual pipes. And that tab performance ain't no joke. Ain't no joke. Y'all know how much I love Vance and Hines on my Harleys, but I don't know. I don't know this tab performance sounds crazy. I love it. All right, so we're gonna turn right here. Vroom, vroom. There we go again, we revving it. And again, and again. Woo, Lord. Mm -mm -mm. Sound gonna make me mess up my pants. <laughs> Oh my God, and this baby's torquey. All right, let's jump into reason number three. Reason number three, I'm kind of wanting a touring bike or a bagger, is the capability of the machine in general for what it's designed for. It basically will give me the opportunity to do more, you know, to venture off to more places, to do some longer rides and do it comfortably without having to stop for gas every hour or less you got a six gallon tank here you know that's plenty of fuel to get you to where you need to go and if you're on like some type of long road where you don't know when the next gas station is coming this is plenty of fuel to get you to that next station without having to be worried versus all my bikes have small tanks i mean let's see i think the v-rod is like a three point something gallon tank and then my sportster is a 3.3 and then the um the ducati i don't even know what size that tank is and my z125 pro it gets insane gas mileage but the tank is really small but it, it can go kind of far but you know it's, it's not meant to do distance on which i'm planning on trying to do a couple distance rides on that thing just to show you can do it but just the capabilities of a touring bike or a bagger it's worth it alone just to be able to say hey i'm about to hop on the bike and i'm about to ride to florida to see my homies like i'm, I'm about to go down to florida to hang out with bari or i'm about to go up to ohio to see the fam or something like that and i could just jump on a touring bike and go do that without even thinking twice about it so yeah the capabilities is definitely making me want to get one y'all know we got to make some noise pulling up to the to the light gotta give that harley image <laughs> no one's paying me any attention man that thing got torque <laughs> another reason is just to have one just to have one of these in my arsenal in case y'all don't know my goal is to own every type or style of motorcycle someday i want them all i want a bagger i want an adventure bike i want a dual sport i want another super sport i want them all i want one of every kind of damn bike so of course you gotta have a bagger just to say i got one so like when the bagger bros go bagger broing or go out on they baggers, you know, I could pull mine out and I could bagger bro with them, you know, 
that's another reason and reason number five is just because you know i'm getting a little bit older i'm getting older not saying that baggers are for older people but it's kind of a more refined type of motorcycle it's made to cruise made to tour a lot of people do crazy things on these bikes though i probably would be one of those people doing some crazy shit but i was gonna say like it probably would get me in less trouble or less likely for me to get in trouble on one of these but to be honest i probably would still be putting myself in situations that could potentially get me in trouble so it is what it is but just because you know i'm i'm, I'm climbing up there in age and i i have never owned a bagger so you know i feel like a bagger is that staple of i've reached this certain point in my life to where i need a bagger like even my buddy lou who is all about sports bikes that's all he's about is nothing but sport bikes he don't even have a sport bike right now he got a bagger he came and picked up a uh what he got a street glide he got a street glide and a z125 pro like he don't even have a sport bike right now now i know he's gonna get another one but he has a bagger because once you get to a certain point you need that bagger in your life i kept on claiming that i'm not to that point but after being out here riding these bikes so much i, I actually might be to that point comment down below any things i may have left off that are reasons to want to get a bagger that some other people may think of and um give me some other reasons why i might want a bagger i know i got a few reasons of why i don't have a bagger and why i probably won't have one within <laughs> the next year or so which i'll make another video talking about that but comment down below let me know what you think of this road king as well i know i didn't talk about it that much but if y'all want to see the full review video on this road king which isn't like a super review it's me having fun being excited about it um check it out on speedway harley davidson's page i'll drop a link to their youtube channel in the description below it's a bunch of review videos on there make sure y'all go check those out as well but i'm almost back up here i'm gonna do one more little fun pull if i can probably won't be able to with this big ass school bus in front of me but and, and this country man in front of me but we gonna see we gonna see this light goes really fast so i probably won't even make it i'm gonna try though i saw you slow down cuz trying to make me miss the light dude welcome to speedway harley davidson y'all like them graphics on the building they're kind of cool right i actually got the option to design I, I designed these graphics that are on the building you see amy's right there on the building and then um i designed that service graphics on that door i designed all of these right here these windows what do y'all think what y'all think of them designs i love it i love it all right i'm about to turn around all right let's get this bike back inside but make sure you subscribe to the channel like this video comment down below uh share the content bell notification hit it hit it y'all help that algorithm help your boy out but uh yeah i'll check y'all out in that next one deuces Doo -doo. Voila.